temperatures as well. Francine made landfall last night in Louisiana as a Category 2 hurricane and brought hurricane force winds and uh, lots of flooding. And it's going to continue to track up here into the Midwest as a tropical storm. And we'll start to increase in clouds from this system starting later this afternoon and then into the overnight tonight. But all of its remnants really do stay south of us, and we're really hoping to see some rain as a lot of the area of Ohio, most of the state is in a drought right now. Exceptional drought for the southeastern portions and northwestern Ohio in a moderate drought. Even for us, seeing abnormally dry grounds and even a moderate drought here for parts of Columbiana County. And don't really expect this to change much. We get a new update later this morning, but we've been dry for the past several days. We'll continue to be dry here as we go throughout the rest of this week and into next week. But for the next couple of days, temperatures are starting off in the 50s, warming up into the low 80s here. Mostly sunny skies, even a really nice evening tonight. Temperatures falling in the low 70s. Start to pick up in clouds, though, later today and into the overnight, partly cloudy. Tomorrow morning, starting those temperatures off in the uh, mid to upper 50s. And throughout the day, seeing lots of sunshine tomorrow, too, in the low 80s. For football, looking great. Kickoff time in the upper 70s and then um, even as the night goes on, temperatures stay comfortable in the upper 60s. So 78 degrees for that kickoff time, starting partly sunny. Then those scattered clouds throughout the night. For today, though, we'll have a high temperature of 84 degrees, mostly sunny. Winds coming out of the southeast, 5 to 10 miles per hour, 57 overnight tonight. Scattered clouds. And then tomorrow, 82 and partly sunny in the rest of that seven-day forecast. We do look good for that football for that YSU game there on Saturday, partly sunny in the mid-80s for the weekend. Picking up in clouds next week for Monday, but we do have some rain chances there for Tuesday and Wednesday. We're hoping that holds 